Learn with Eddie. Hi, Eddie. <laughs> Ready to have some more fun with animals? <laughs> I'm glad you brought your binoculars because today we're going to talk about birds. That way you'll catch them mid flight. <laughs> you don't get it? They're birds and they fly. <laughs> well, never mind. But today we're going to look at winged animals. <laughs> <laughs> no, Eddie. Bees uh -huh. have wings, but they're not birds. They're insects. E like flies and butterflies. <laughs> You're missing all of them today. E Fairies aren't birds either. They're fairy tale creatures. <laughs> birds are animals with wings, but they're also covered in feathers, have a beak like mouth, and don't have teeth. Oh like doves, parrots, eagles. <laughs> I bet you guys know many birds. Which is your favorite? Let Eddie know in the comments. <laughs> Come on, let's draw a few birds so you'll see it clearer. For example, uh -huh. do you know this bird? <laughs> <laughs> of course you do, it's a flamingo. See what I was telling you? It has wings, a long beak, and a feathery body. <laughs> and I bet you know it well because it's got your favorite color, right? <laughs> Pink! That's it! You can also recognize it by its long legs. <laughs> Sometimes they even stand on just one of them. <laughs> Let's see if you know the next one. Uh -huh. It's called a toucan. It's a common bird of South America. Oh. See anything that gets your attention? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's it. It's recognizable for its huge beak. Do you know what color it is? Mm. You're right. It's orange. <laughs> the beak and the feet. The breast and this part around the eyes is usually a different color. Which do you think would look good? <laughs> You're right, green is perfect. Since it's a bird, it has a beak, a feathery body, and wings to fly. <laughs> Although you should know that not all birds can fly. Yeah. Even though they have wings, they can't fly with them. Uh -huh. It happens in penguins and ostriches, for example. Oh. Also, these little birds called kiwis. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're called just like the fruit. <laughs> and they're also similar in color. Remember what color kiwis are? <laughs> exactly, brown. Kiwis, like penguins and ostriches, can't fly even though they have wings. Uh -huh. But they're still birds. <laughs> <laughs> On the other hand, you're not a bird but you can fly. But that's because you're magical. <laughs> Hi, Eddie. <laughs> Ready to learn more stuff about animals? <laughs> Why the face? Remember what animals we've learnt about? <laughs> Snakes and iguanas are reptiles. <laughs> a dog and a pig, those are mammals like humans. You're just missing one. <laughs> the shark and the clownfish, those are fish, of <laughs> course. So we're still missing birds and amphibians. <laughs> I see that you're not too interested in learning new things. <laughs> I have an idea. How about if we go over what we've seen, uh -huh. but playing? <laughs> Let's play making up new animals. Uh -huh. <laughs> it's very easy. We choose two animals that already exist and combine them into a new one. Oh. I'm sure the result will be really funny. <laughs> 
What's the weirdest and funniest animal you've come up with, guys? Let us know in the comments. I'm Is sure it? they'll make us laugh. Come on, Eddie. Let's get the rock rolling. <laughs> For example, think of a mammal. The elephant. Perfect. It's a mammal because it grew in its mother's belly. It's warm-blooded and breathes through a nose. Well, through a trunk. <laughs> now think of a fish. A seahorse. Very good, Eddie. Although it looks like a horse, it's a fish because it breathes through gills. An elephant's head on a seahorse's body makes... A sea elephant. <laughs> I told you this game was a blast. What color shall we paint it? An orange sea elephant. Great idea. Shall we do another? A turtle. It's an amphibian because it lays eggs. It has scales and it's cold-blooded. Okay, we'll use it for the body. Can I choose the head? A rabbit! Look, Eddie, we've created a turt habit! <laughs> or a rab turtle! I'm not too sure. What colour do you want it to be? Blue and yellow? What a mix! How about if the body is yellow and the head blue? There you have it! Come on, let's do one more. Can you think of another animal? Maybe one that you like a lot? <laughs> of course, you've always loved unicorns. It doesn't really belong to any species, but we'll use it anyway. <laughs> well, if it's going to have a unicorn body, it could have uh -huh. an uh -huh. Eddie head. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you weren't expecting that. <laughs> I'd ask you for a color, but I'm sure which one you're going to choose. <laughs> of course, it has to be your favorite color, pink. Let's <laughs> color it in and see how it looks. <laughs> Done! I present Eddie the Dinocorn!